Hey everyone, Carlo here. Welcome to the vlog. This is the channel where we talk about sneakers, life, and tech. And for this episode, we're going to go sneaker shopping once again over at Titan. So to those who don't know and who don't live in the Philippines, Titan is a basketball, sneaker, and lifestyle, lifestyle shop here in the Philippines. So I actually set my appointment with them because you have to set appointments uh, with the current, I, I don't know, like a modified lockdown that we have right now. I'm scheduled for 2 o'clock and we're just about, about to leave. Let's go. The great news is Titan was on 40 to 60% sale. And if you had the app, you can actually get an additional 15% off the net price. So the first set of sneakers that we're going to check out are LeBron's. And we have LeBron 17 lows, and they are now selling for less than 5,000 pesos or $100. So this one is 4,857 pesos, less an additional 15%, which is an absolute steal. We also have it in the black and red color, which I also did the review on in a previous episode. Link to that can be found down below. You also have the LeBron 7 Fairfax, which is a quick shout out, by the way, to Mr. Sean Santa Maria, one of our good friends uh, on the YouTube space. Now the Fairfax, just like the LeBron 7 Retro All-Star, is selling for 5,937, less an additional 15%, used to sell for 9,895. Not a bad price, guys. Now, if you want the LeBron 17 highs, uh, they come in different colorways, still available in Titan. They're going for 5,900 pesos, less an additional 15%. This used to sell for a little over 9,800. Again, massive, massive steal if you're a fan of LeBron shoes. By the way, what are your thoughts on black and red LeBrons? Let me know in the comment section. Would love to hear from you guys. They also have a bunch of Kyrie basketball shoes. Uh, the latest one being, I think, the All-Star in the red and gold color. This one used to go for 6,745. They're now selling it for 4,000 pesos, less 15%. Again, massive steal. They also had different colorways of the PG4s. This one is one of the more comfortable basketball sneakers out there, and they are selling it. Are you ready for it? For less than 3,500 pesos. Again, less 15%. Crazy price for great shoes. They also had the KD13, of course, a recently released prior to the lockdown. It's now selling for a little over 6,000, wherein it used to sell for 7,600 pesos. We also saw a bunch of Zoom Freaks in different colorways, from the All-Star to the earlier versions. And this one is now selling for less than 4,000 pesos, just 3,777. Again, less 15%. That makes it what? Less than 3,500 for one of the best basketball shoes that you can pick up today. Now moving over to the Jordan wall of the shop, we have a Jordan 4 over here. This one is now selling, well, not, not that much of a discount, but a little over 7,400, less 15%. That's already a good deal in my opinion. And we also have a Jordan 13. I forgot what this is called. I think it's like the Chinese New Year or something. I'll double check. Uh, this one also came in a big pink box. So if you are a fan of the colorway of this one, then uh, wow. Go for it, man. Now, this one used to sell for over 12,000, but with the discounts, including the 15%, now going for just 6,000 pesos. Ba bam! We also had the Jordan 34s. They're now selling for a little over 6,400 pesos, less 15%. That brings the price down to around 5,000. Original price of 8,000. Different colorways. This one is a clean triple white one. Of course, you have several Westbrook basketball streetwear sneakers. I say that because they look really funky and they're so striking and they will definitely grab attention with the different color blocking, blockings and textures of the shoe. This one used to go for 6,700 something pesos. With the sale, it's been knocked down to 4,000. Less the 15%, bringing it down to the 3,000 peso levels. Different colorways available for a fan of Westbrook. Now is the time to buy shoes, guys, over at Titan. Now moving over to the Under Armour wall, we have a couple of sneakers, of course, from Stephen Curry. Uh, his latest shoes in different colorways are now being sold for less than 4,000 pesos. 3,997 to be exact, less 15% off. That brings it down to less than three five for brand new shoes from Stephen Curry. Man, the crazy, crazy deal. So those are just some of the shoes that we saw over at Titan. And now at this point in the vlog, 
I'll head on over back to the condo and I'll show you guys what I ended up picking up, copying, buying, whatever you want to call it. And we're back here at the home studio or my home office. And before anything, our wristwatch check of the day, we have uh, the Bape Seiko. So if you guys want to see the review of this wristwatch, I'll put the link down below. Just check it out if you are interested. So what did I end up buying? Now, I initially wanted to pick up one of the Zoom Freaks, but unfortunately, they didn't have it anymore in my size. So I ended up buying the Jordan 13 uh, CNY that I think it's called like Pale Ivory. That's like the official colorway. And I ended up buying it mainly because I've never had one. If It always caught my eye every time I would see it online. And I honestly don't know how and when I will wear it. I'll figure out the way. <laughs> but this is the shoe. So I ended up buying this for a little less than 6,000 pesos, which isn't a bad deal considering the, the, the official SRP or the first, the, the price that it sold for initially was over 12,000. So it's like a, it's like a 50% discount. And, and the reason I think why I ended up buying this uh, or specifically this silhouette is because I just really enjoyed wearing uh, the Jordan Flints that came out and I copped recently. I've been wearing it in the house though. And every time I would go out and that's probably the reason why I wanted to get out and buy another, uh, well, Jordan 13. So as I mentioned earlier, it comes in this really big pink box. I said geek in pink, right? And if you pop it open, you have that really nice tissue paper communicating how premium this sneaker is. And it is premium, guys. It's selling for over 13, uh, over 12,000. That's pricey for a Jordan. And this is what the shoe ba bam looks like. Take a look at that. So you have some sort of pattern uh, with an, I don't know, some sort of different kinds of suede. So you have multiple layers, the this one over here, and then you have the brown suede, and then you have that really nice pink accent for the outsole. You have the hologram over here, which is the trademark of the Jordan 13. Uh, Jordan Jumpman logo over there, the tongue tab, and man, wow crazy <laughs> well I, i'll figure out a way to wear this and if i do i'll probably post it on instagram so, oh by the way if you guys haven't followed me on instagram yet uh check it out i usually post a lot of well power up with words of wisdom snippets as well as pictures of a lot of shoes and my cat over there so yeah this is our cop for the day when i dropped by titan 50 percent off because of the additional 15 percent ah, wow Crazy, crazy, crazy. I'll do the on feet and the review in another video, probably in some sort of like update format in an upcoming vlog. So just watch out for it when it drops in the coming days ahead. Now, before we end the vlog, I just want to share with you guys my feelings and my experience shopping in physical shops uh, ever since we entered GCQ and got out of the super strict uh, ECQ or lockdown here in the Philippines. So for Titan, I actually felt really safe because number one, you had to set an appointment so you know that the shop wouldn't be crowded, that there wouldn't be a lot of people in there. So I booked the appointment via the website or I think by the app. I set it for two o'clock. I was there uh, when, I, and when I entered, they took my temperature. I, they logged me in their book, no contactless. I, I used some alcohol and then they let me go around the shop. And everybody in the staff was properly, I don't know, protected for themselves and myself, obviously. So they had gloves, they had face masks, they had face shields they were friendly and it, it was really a nice shopping experience because I, I literally had the shop to myself so I really felt safe you know <laughs> you know what I mean so I think that I, I appreciate the fact that they're doing that I super appreciate that they're doing it by, by appointment and not just you know letting anybody in uh, and yeah I just, I just want to give a, a big shout out to Titan for for doing that for taking care of their customers and taking care of their staff in that way so a uh, good job I, I, I enjoyed the time and it, it it took me back a bit to the time when I when I could actually usually go out and shop for sneakers physically unlike now where most of the shopping is done online so again shout out to the guys over at Titan Fort BGC and Titan management for doing an amazing job uh, in ensuring that the shopping experience both for the customers and their staff would be awesome and that wraps up our vlog for today. I hope you guys are all doing fine. I hope you're okay. And again, reminder, if you guys are going to go out, wear a mask, sanitize your hands, practice social distancing, because COVID is still out there. The virus is still out there. Regardless if it is ECQ, GCQ, MCQ, MGCQ, the virus is still there. Peace, God bless. What's up? Boom.